Well, hello and welcome to what amounts to football heaven. It doesn't get a whole lot better than this. The conditions are utopian. The sky is blue and the players are with us for a football match so widely and keenly anticipated. Truly, this is pristine and the uh, level of expectation and excitement is reflected in the smiling faces of the crowd. They know it means so much and they also experience between them a great sense of privilege at uh, being able to attend this most special of games. And this must be amongst the favoured arenas of supporters all over the world. It really does have a very special feel to it. The action has already started. And that's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. Oh, real! It's bounced out! Oh, he's managed to get himself offside. Keeper sends it forward. So his contractual situation is sorted. One less concern for the manager. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Vrani tries to get it forward quickly. Just brushed off the ball there. Questions were asked. He's given the answers. Hoists it forward. Herve. Referee has just said play on. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. Goyos. Now the counter. of the outcome it is good to see someone running at the defense like that cuts it out loose ball who's gonna get there he's away it's heavy goal Juventus any thoughts on the goal well his most important job there was to keep the shot down and he did that without any problems that's good concentration man. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. And it's played forward. Hasseldine goes looking. He's played him through. Hervé is flagged offside. Forward it goes. Oh, good interception. Well, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. And it's half-time here. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first-half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain the momentum now and finish the job. Juventus, happy with the teams, heading into half-time, 1-0 up. 
just back from your break. Has a pop! He has done it! A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front, and they really commit forward in numbers, too. It was all very well drilled. Juventus get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Great leap! He will be livid with himself. Do I really need to tell you, Peter, that he has to do better, especially from there? Hervé, Goyos, oh, where he sorted that out. He can get that clear. Hervé plays it short. And he's there to cut it out. And that has been clubbed away. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Herve shoots! Herve gets flagged offside. Castledine, and he's away. Schneiderlin tries to get it forward quickly. Castledine. A real chance if he can get through. He's gone for it! In it goes! And they are dragging it back! Game on again! An exhibition in how to finish with a minimum of fuss. We have got ourselves a game here. Well, it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline. This game plan could near well reward them with an equaliser. And he's cut it out. Jorza plays it forward. Kasseldine. Juventus suddenly appear frail. Yes, from comfort zone to a stage of uncertainty, perhaps. And they can't drift into a carelessness or or this could get away from them. He's got the ball, he's tries a shot! Fenerbahce are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Hervé. Hervé! Another big chance that gets away. This is proving to be a very good spell. The intensity is great, but uh, they've got to make it count. Benabache can make their change now with uh, a break in play. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. 
He gets past his man as a hit. It's off target and by quite a way. This could fall anywhere. And it's played forward. Four added minutes on the board. Juventus just have to run down the clock. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Hervé. And that will be the final act. Well, whatever the shortcomings on either side, it was a great game to watch. Just one between them. Let me look back on the game then, Jim. Juventus have some very strong runners from midfield, and it's not often you'll see a team be so effective by advancing through the middle like that, but this was very impressive, the way they cut through the heart of that defence. Just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin for joining us and to wish you a very good day.